Today we're in Ballygloonan Railway Station where part of The Quiet Man was filmed. We're going to be talking to Mike Ward who organised a photo shoot in 1940s style right here at the station. So Mike, tell me what all of this is in aid of. Yeah, this is in aid of uh, promoting the, the Quiet Man movie mainly and it's to do with the restoration of Ballygloonan Station which played a very important part in the movie itself. The opening scenes, as everybody knows, this is where it all happened. John Wayne stepped off the train and uh, met the, uh, the local folks of Inish Free and immediately was thrown into confusion when he asked the directions. And um, it, was, it was a comedy romantic film and it was, you know, nobody realised it at the time when the movie was made, not even John Ford himself, the director. He was absolutely fascinated with the, how it was received by everybody. And uh, it was, at the time, you know, a phenomenal thing to happen in Ireland, you know, because it was the first time Hollywood ever used any locations here and so on and so forth. But most important of all, it later became so ingrained in Irish culture and heritage that 65 years on, it's still one of the top in the 100 best ever known movies in the world and that's incredible thing to be able to say that so we could say 65 years ago Maureen O'Hara uh, John Wayne uh, all those great actors uh, and needless to say John Ford one of the best ever uh, directors in Hollywood this is where it all happened so what we want to, would like to do ideally is to see the this beautiful little iconic station, probably the most iconic in Ireland actually, uh, we'd like to see it restored and we're doing our very best to make people aware of the importance of this to our culture and our heritage. Hopefully we'll one day see it all back and we'll see the little station being centrepiece to what it should be you know, and appreciated by everybody. So that's what this is all about. Great, and what exactly is going on here today? Now, uh, what we're doing today, we just had a little bit of a fun shoot and uh, we were very, very lucky to get, you know, some wonderful people here together. And uh, we enjoyed ourselves, we had a, a, a good time and we went to the trouble of having a few props here and there and uh, we think, you know, this is going to be good, it's good for the promotion. And uh, we have a huge following, particularly through Facebook, that's on the social networks where we have, you know, maybe upwards of 70,000 Irish diaspora and they have an incredible interest in this and most of that is based on the social network Facebook. Uh, the particular group that I'm involved with was one that was launched in 2010 and our main focus on that was to bring attention and uh, you know, give a bit of feedback to the public there of what's happening over here in Ireland uh, with the locations and that kind of thing. And we want to make the public aware of you know what the effort we're putting into this to revive the whole thing. And we're very we're doing very very successfully. In that particular group we have just about uh, I think it's ten thousand five hundred at the moment, and that keeps climbing all the time. So there's a great awareness about it out there. So through that. This is the project of the, the uh, Save the Quiet Man Cottage that is about uh, based around the cottage that featured centrepiece in the movie and obviously Ballygloonan Station. So the two of them are very much linked and hopefully we'll see both of them revived within, you know, hopefully a few years or something like that. So we're doing all we can to bring the public awareness to it and very successfully so far. And let's hope it goes like that. Yeah. Fantastic. Thanks so much for talking to us today, Mike. You're very welcome indeed.